this video, we'll be looking at how to apply the Spigen Tempered Glass Screen Protector for the iPhone 14 Pro. And you'll have to excuse the echo in here because I'm recording from the bathroom. To which you're probably thinking, why are you recording in the bathroom? Stick with me here, it'll all become clear in just a few moments. I recently went to the Apple Store to have the screen replaced on this iPhone 14 Pro using my Apple Care Plus warranty because the screen had some pretty severe scratches due to a drop. However, Apple informed me that Apple Care Plus warranty does not replace screens because of scratches alone. That's considered cosmetic damage and they'll only replace the screen if it's cracked. So it was at that point I decided I need to invest in a good screen protector. The Spigen Easy Fit Tempered Glass Screen Protector gets rave reviews on Amazon. And so in this video, I'll be showing you some tips and tricks to help you install it with ease. If you're like me, the idea of getting any dust or debris under the screen protector would be something you can't unsee and it would drive you crazy. The collected consensus on the internet is turning the shower on and allowing the steam from the hot water to fill the bathroom just to the point where you start to get a little steam on the mirror will cause all the dust to settle and it will make it so it's less likely for dust to be on your screen when you're doing the install. Additionally, if you wanna go a little further, you can turn your AC and heater off so it's not stirring up air in the room as well. While you're waiting for that to steam up, you wanna wipe down your counter really well with a damp cloth to remove any dust and then come back with a relatively dust-free dry towel to dry it off. The kit comes with two screen protectors, instructions for how to apply, a squeegee for removing bottles, two cleaning wipes, a microfiber cloth, and dust removal stickers, which are key. Start by giving the screen a good wipe with the microfiber cloth to remove any smudges, and then proceed to clean it with one of the cleaning cloths. It's best to take these while they're still folded and give a wipe on the screen to remove any large dirt and debris, and then open it up and use the rest to clean the rest of the screen. Now you can take your dust removal stickers and use those to just gently place on the screen to pull off any light dust or debris. Once you feel like things are pretty clean, you want to move quickly to remove the adhesive back and then pretty quickly move down to the iPhone so that you don't pick up any extra dust or debris. Slide side to side and you'll notice the screen protector begin to apply. Wait 30 seconds. All right, it's been 30 seconds, so I'm going to remove the sticker now. Gently pull away from the device slowly so you don't introduce any new air bubbles by pulling too quickly. Use the center section to push the install template away from the phone. I've got a couple of bubbles, it appears, on the front, but those are actually probably just in the protective cover. As you see, when I remove that, everything is bubble free. Should you have any bubbles, use the included squeegee to push those toward the edge of the device. Make sure you hang on to your microfiber cloth, your squeegee, and especially your dust removal stickers and the cleaning wipes for when you need to install the other screen protector. And that is how you install the Spigen Easy Fit Tempered Glass Screen Protector for the iPhone 14 Pro. This is by far the best screen protector installation experience I've ever had, thanks to the Easy Fit installation template that helps you align the screen protector perfectly. If you'd like to pick one of these up for yourself, there's links down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching.